time. Get over here. All right, I'll, uh, I'll start packing up. Now, Javi, you need to hurry. Look, I'm not giving you shit, okay? I'm just... You weren't here when Dad was sick, okay? I get it, but... You need to fucking be here when he goes. I know. All right, I'm just on my way. <sighs> David! It's David, hey! Hey, David. I had to leave my car. It's traffic. It's just backed up for miles. He's dead. No. No. I, I, I tried. You're a piece of shit. You know that? One time. Just the one goddamn time that you needed to be here. I tried. Please, I tried. Oh, you tried. You fucking tried? Everyone's here. They've been here for days, and where the fuck were you? <clears throat> we're there, all around him. People who love him, all around him. And he's scared. I'm seeing the panic in his eyes, and he's searching the room. Donde esta Javier? Donde esta mi hijo? I'm there, right beside him, holding his hand. Like a good son. And he doesn't even see me. He doesn't even see me because he's looking for you. You don't think there's a million places we'd rather be? He was my dad too, all right? I mean, you're not, you're not the only one dealing with this. And what a fine son you turned out to be. Uncle Javi? Why, why are you fighting? I could hear you from inside. Don't worry, Gabe. We're just horsing around. Just a joke between brothers, you know? Yeah. Your uncle doesn't know how to take anything seriously. Go inside, mijo. We'll be in in a minute. Go on. It's okay. Inside. I got it. I should call someone. Pick up the body. Yeah. I love you, little brother. You know that, right? I know. You think I was jealous of you. No, I, I don't think anything. Well, I was. For a long time. You've lost more than I'll ever have. But maybe something good can come out of all this. Because we need you here. It's time to grow up. You can't run from this. Not anymore. Time to take some responsibility. Javi. Kate. I'm so sorry, Javi. I'm so sorry. Thank you. Let's go inside. Your mom needs you. What happened? Come on. Mama. Where were you? I tried. I tried. I'm so sorry. 
He's gone, mijo. He's gone. He's in a better place, mama. David made arrangements with your father before he passed. No puedo conectarme. Dicen que no hay servicio. You thirsty, baby? You want some juice? Grandpa's cup was empty. You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, Yaya. People's awake. Where's your sister? <laughs> keys! Where the fuck are the keys? Take Dad's car. <laughs> keys are on the dash. <laughs> Mama, get the kids. Meet at the hospital. Don't take the highway. It's blocked. <gasps> I'll bring the van around. Where's Mari? I, I don't know. Mija. Mariana! From the stars! Mariana, we have to go. Yaya's hurt. Come on, honey. We have to go. No, no, no! 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 It's okay. No! It's okay. County General Hospital. I know the way. Tell me when it reaches the campfire. Man, I don't think I've seen this many. It's definitely growing. Yeah, not a great sign. Damn it, I left my water bottle. 
Her just got there. Just under four hours. Come on. We should keep moving while the kids are asleep. Yeah. Looks like the herd is speeding up a little. I thought it was drifting southwest, but I'm not sure anymore. Every time I think we should just bed down somewhere and wait for it to pass, I can't shake the thought of us getting caught in the middle of it. It just keeps coming. It's slow, but that almost makes it worse. It makes it feel like we're in control. We should keep moving. It worked for us so far. As long as we stay supplied, we're fine. Yeah, maybe you're right. The van isn't so bad. We'll figure it out. We always do. Hey, I'm gonna sneak a smoke. I can't believe you found weed. Are you kidding? People were probably growing this before they realized they needed food. All right, just, you know, make it quick. I don't want you waking the kids. Relax. Mariana's got headphones on and Gabe is drooling. I think we're in the clear. You want some? Yeah. Okay, sure. <coughs> we are setting an awesome example. <coughs> Don't judge me. Oh, when I found out David had kids, I told him, I am not changing who I am around them. <laughs> and when he proposed, I reminded him that I'm not exactly stepmother material. <laughs> Case in point. He was reassuring, but you know, I could tell he was worried about it. I knew he'd try to get me to change. <laughs> or at least he'd hope that being around the kids more would change me, you know? I suppose it did. Do you miss him? I think about that a lot. Honestly, I'm not sure. I used to talk shit about all those mothers who'd go on about raising their kids being the hardest thing in the world. Oof. Gabe's making me start to think they had a point. <laughs> His mood swings are just... Ugh. Some days I just want to leave him by the side of the road. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> Jesus, obviously. Look, I didn't sign up for this either. Sometimes life decides for you. That sounded deep, didn't it? <laughs> uh, no. No, it didn't. Look, I love these kids. But I could do without Gabe reminding me I'm not his mother whenever he's pissed. Nah, he's a teenager. Puberty. Hormones. Oh yeah. The second you start getting boners, the whole world starts to get dark. <sighs> what are you talking about? It sounds delightful compared to dealing with bloody underwear. <laughs> Christ. I need to get laid. <laughs> I realized that was an awkward transition. Sorry about that. Come on, Kate. You know we can't do that. Who said I meant with you? Hmm. Uh, what's that smell? That's gross. Hey, Mariana. Shouldn't you be, uh, sleeping or something? I already know you guys do drugs. That's a pretty severe way of phrasing it, Mariana. Don't tell Gabe. He's the one who told me. Oh, oh my god. You're even smoking in the car now? All right. Everyone roll the windows down before you all get contact high. We're about to make a supply stop.
You praying for our safety, Mari? I'm praying I find a candy bar. <laughs> All right. What do we actually need? Uh, a candy bar? Pretty much everything. If it looks useful, let's use it. All right. Well, let's start with some gas and move up from there. Hey, where are you going? Okay, that's cool. Have fun. Oh, Jesus. It never ends with him. I hate when they fight like that. I really hate it. It's like all Gabe wants to do is argue. Well, that makes two of us. But we're stuck with him, so... At least you have your headphones. Yeah, but... The batteries have been dead for a couple of weeks. I mostly wear them to fool you guys. Well, when you put it that way, I wish I had a pair too. You can borrow mine if you want. I might just have to do that. Be nice to find some dinner. In a junkyard. You never know. These past four years, people have been hoarding all kinds of shit in all kinds of places. Oh, and Mari, if there's any trouble, you would find one of these cars. Yeah? Lock yourself in and don't come out. Not even once it's quiet. And wait as long as you can. Okay. Good girl. Waste oil. No use to us. Oh, that's gross. Okay, now I'm sorry I did that. Acetylene, handy for welding. Not much else. I wouldn't have minded having one of these back in the day. Come to Papa. Barely anything. I'll need to find more. Ugh, I don't think these tires would fit the van. Bingo. Some sort of fuel tank. Looks like there's more to see up here. Any luck? 
Some. But not enough. Gabe? Hey, Gabe. Let's go take a look over there. Gabe? Stay close to Javi. Got it? Oh, all right. Hey, look. There's one they never took to pieces. Good catch. locked. All right. Here goes nothing. <laughs> Fuck yeah. <laughs> Look at all that fuel. This is going to take a while. Oh well, at least it had some gas. Looks pretty picked over. Looks like it came from in there. Gabe, stay close. Might be able to get in through the hatch. Locked. <clears throat> Not gonna be able to pry this open. Damn it. Gabe, come check this out. Not the cleanest place. Well, no muertos at least. Let's just be careful. Are you kidding me? Lucky for you, they put enough preservatives in this stuff to last for centuries. Well, there's enough food in here to keep us going for a long time. Oh, check it out. This is actual honest-to-God pudding! Seriously? And it's not just food. There's a mattress. There's blankets. Someone else's mattress someone else's blankets. We need to just take our gas and get on the road. 
This place does have a funny feeling about it. And if Muertos were to somehow surround us... Great. Now I'm officially creeped out. Come on, one night. We bunk down, eat a real meal. It would be nice not to sleep in the van for a change. Please. The herd is coming, if it's not here already. We should go and get ahead of it, before it's too late. The fence is reinforced. We'll be fine. We found this. Why can't we just enjoy it? Javi, can we? We could stretch out, sleep well for once? Come on, you know it's not a big deal. The kids are right. We deserve a little break from the van. Yes! <clears throat> kids, go wild. Just stay indoors and keep your ears open. <laughs> Just in case. Cool. You can have your own. I don't know how I always end up being the mean stepmom, and you get to be the cool uncle. We should be able to switch roles now and then. Look, it's just a nice break. We get to spend the night with four walls instead of four wheels. I think we deserve that. Whatever. It's fine. Grab some gas. We're out of here in a few hours. Hey, uh, wait, but you... You're the cool one, remember? She'd expect it from you. What the fuck you think you're doing with our gas? Go on, speak up! I'm sorry, man. Look, it's just a can. We needed it really we? bad. I fucking knew it. There's more than just you out here. You ain't the loner type. I can tell. I know you got people. Look, don't worry about them. They took off and then they're not coming back. Just up and left you, huh? <laughs> Fan out and look for the others. Lonnie, you're with me. Hey! You assholes in there! I got your boy! You don't want him getting shot, you best come out there careful with your hands up! Go on, you first. You get ambushed by your own people, that shit's gonna make my day. Open it real slowly. Looks like you and your friends had a real feast, huh? You can't just take what you like. Look, we hardly took any. Uh, really, someone must have been here before us. Look, I, I, I get it, all right? You're starving. Who the fuck is it? At the end of your rope, thought you hit pay dirt. Honest mistake. But I got this sneaky fucking feeling <clears throat> that you're full of shit. I ain't gonna let it be like the last time some assholes rolled on us. Keep an eye on this dickhead. I'm gonna grab some cuffs. You got it. Just chill, okay? No need to make this any harder. Look, your buddy's not thinking straight. So let's talk, okay? You and me, we, we can get this sorted out. No, it's his call. Look, man, this doesn't have to go. What the fuck was that noise? What you got hiding under there, boy? If you know something, you better spill it. You don't want me finding out for myself. Ah! Guys, get the fuck in here! Holy shit!
Hey, my family, where are they? What did you do with my family? Fucking asshole. Just do us both a favor and pretend you're still asleep. I wouldn't start talking if I were you. You're lucky we do things a certain way. I'm already tempted to put a bullet in your brain for what you did to Lonnie back there. If we start talking, I'm gonna get angry. We still got a haul ahead of us, and I'm not about to listen to you. What the hell? Stop! Stop! Ah, shit! Oh, no, no! Good. Just keep looking forward. Look, I'm already having a bad fucking day here. This is not what it looks like. What it looks like is you shot an unarmed guy in the back. Or is that not what I saw? Okay, now don't do anything stupid. Cause I'll shoot a lot quicker than you did. You're a kid. Whoa, wait, did you do that? With the tree? I was trying to stop the truck. Oh, shit. Yeah, you stopped it all right. The tree fell slower than I thought it would. Put your hands up and close your eyes. Look, I'm the victim here. We're all victims. Oh, so it's okay for you to rob me? This is payment for saving you. Hey, that's for my niece. She loves chocolate more than anything. I promised it to her. Please. Keep your eyes closed and count to a hundred before you go. Wait, just... My family. I need to get back to them. We were attacked and I don't... Look, I just need to know where I am. We were driving down the 522 and, and that's when we found the junkyard. They're still there. I need to get back to them. I know where that is. You said you were driving? In our van, yeah. I'll take you to the junkyard if you let me have your van. I get you there in one piece, then I drive away. That van is our home. It's all we got. That sounds like a no. How about you just give me directions like a normal person? How about I shoot you and take the van anyway? This is a better deal for you. Let's go. This really necessary? I don't know you, I don't trust you, and I'm not taking any chances. So it's safer for both of us if you're tied up. Hey, that's fine with me. I don't trust you either. Glad we understand each other. The name's Javier, by the way. People call me Javi. Clementine. Clementine. Cool name. If you say so.
You get it then. Look, you don't want to talk? Fine. But how about you give me that gun back so I can at least defend myself? For all I'd know, you'd turn around and use it on me. Look, I'm not gonna shoot you. You shot the other guy. Well, you didn't tie me up and stick me in a truck. Muertos. The herd caught up with us. Muertos. What do you call them? Walkers. Well, what do you call the ones that run? They're all fucking walkers, okay? Look, I'm just... I'm not used to being around other people. Not for a while, anyway. Yeah. Well, it shows. Meaning what? Meaning you could sure use a dust-up on those people skills. So, who's at this junkyard? My brother's kids. And his wife. It's impressive. Surviving this long. Not sure how you did it. Just... keeping everyone together like that. I did whatever I had to do to protect them. Kept them out of trouble the best I could. Sucks. What? That sometimes it's not enough. Well, how about you? You must have been pretty young when this shit started. I was. But some people looked out for me too. What happened to them? Same thing that happens to everyone. Shit. We can't stay here. There's a town up ahead. We can stay there until the herd passes. Otherwise, we're walker food. Fine. Whatever you say. Thank you. Don't make me regret this. Come on! Francine, one of these days, those doors are gonna close, and your ass will be on the other side. <laughs> yeah, and when that day comes, Trip, I promise, I'll eat you first. It's Clementine, right? You staying a while this time? No. Once the walkers pass, I'm taking this guy to a junkyard off the highway. My family might be trapped there, hiding from some very bad dudes. Well, shit. I'm truly sorry to hear that. This herd rolled in pretty quick. We're hoping it's gone just as fast. So, just keep your heads down and steer clear of trouble. You got me? There's too much going on outside the walls tonight. We'll be cool. Just need a place to ride out the herd, that's all. All right. I'm gonna hold you to that. And I wouldn't recommend changing your mind if you wanna hang on to all your teeth, that is. Now head on in. I got shit to do. Well, welcome to Prescott. It's a pretty cool place, actually. Built from an old airstrip, I guess. The people, on the other hand, they're not my favorite. 
Usually I'm in and out as quick as I can manage. Hey, what's the problem? You have some sort of history here that I should know about? Not really. I just... I know what people are capable of. Hey, Javi. What's... what's up? My family... They're still out there. Look in the middle of all that. If you guys made it this long, I I'm sure you know... They'll know what to do. Hopefully. Let's go. This way. I gotta see a guy about some bullets. Jeez. I haven't been in a place like this since... Well, you know. It's just like the old days. Listen, I gotta take care of something. Hang tight. Well, wait, wait. What should I do? I don't know. Why don't you make some friends? Chess. Not really my game. I think Gabe used to play, though. Wonder if it's loaded. Play your hand. You're gonna lose, but you don't have to do it in slow motion. Don't try and rush me. <laughs> I know your game. This is my game. Clearly. Always a smart ass. Well, it ain't gonna work. Excuse me. Oh, you again. You got some moves, I'll give you that. Hold on a minute. Don't I note you from somewhere? I don't know. Maybe. Garcia. Javier Garcia. For what it's worth, I think you got screwed on the gambling thing. A lifetime ban. Shit. Should have had a 20-year career. The way I see it, nothing wrong with betting on yourself to win. Honestly, I don't even think about it anymore. Past is the past. Hm. Fair enough. Anyway, I'm Conrad. This here's Francine. He runs the place? I just take his money. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe I'm just letting you win. Oh, actually, if you're the gambling type, game's poker. Five card stud. I'll raise you. What do you think? Should I call or should I fold? Hmm. Don't get too intimidated. I lose more often than I care to admit. He's bluffing. He's got bullshit written all over him. <laughs> Is that a fact? All right. I think I'll listen to the man. Call. Moment of truth. Flip him. Oh, my. Ain't that a pretty sight? Oh, hell yeah! Nice. Oh, calm down, both of you. Thanks for the advice, hon. How's about a drink? On my tab. Bottoms up. Wow, man, this smells like turpentine. <laughs> That's the weak stuff. Don't turn away from me. I'm talking to you. Oh, shit. Hey, what's the point in talking when I already told you a deal is a deal? And it's done. What's going on? This guy ripped me off. I traded him a crate of perfectly good batteries, and he gave me a box of bullets that won't fire. He could have gotten both of us killed. Oh, yeah? And yeah, who the fuck are you, a bodyguard or something? She doesn't need a bodyguard. She can take care of herself. Believe me. Uh, well, you can't even prove those are the bullets I traded you. Oh, hey, Clem, come on. He knows the bullets don't work. Listen to him. He's not even nervous. I could have died because of his bullets. Oh, I'm fucking believable. Look out! <laughs> Hey, listen. Let's all cool down, huh? You were acting crazy. I was too. We just got a little out of hand. That's all. Just give me what I'm owed. Jesus. You've got to get her under control, man. Oh, he 
had a deal. All right, hey, okay, all right, so, hey, we'll, we'll trade back. I'll find some batteries. I don't need batteries. What I need are bullets that won't get me killed. Oh. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. Drop the gun! Right now! Say he attacked you and that he was going for his gun. I fucking warned you! Eli attacked him. I only shot because... Shut it! You done enough talking. Drop it. There's a herd out there and you're firing off a fucking... What the fuck happened here? He attacked Javi, okay? It was self-defense. Enough from you. Did she really have to shoot? Look at my eye, man. Of course she's telling the truth. The guy ripped her off, reached for his gun, and would have shot me if she hadn't stopped him. See? You happy now? <sighs> God damn it. I'm putting you two under lock and key until I figure out what to do with Whoa. you. Oh, hey, what? Are you for real? As real as it gets. Now move it. Got some nerve coming in here fucking up my bar. I oughta punch your fucking lights out. Both of you. But Eli was a grade-A certified dipshit. I'll even have someone come take a look at that cut. Hey. Thanks for having my back at the hangar. That was, um... That was cool of you. Yeah. Well, now you really owe me one. Because you put my ass on the line with these people, and they barely know me. I know. And I'm... Well... I'm saying thanks. Just... don't think this makes us friends or anything. Hello? I'm Eleanor. I'm what passes for a doctor around here. The trip sort of overdoes it sometimes. I hate that I'm treating you in a cage. Like you're some feral animal. And I'm starting to think this trip guy... Kind of a prick. He means well. He's just got a lot on his shoulders. Now, let's see about that wound. Yeah, he got you good. Try to hold still. <clears throat> Why is it always the pretty ones who end up causing the most trouble? As if good looks equal bad behavior or something. Are you calling me pretty? <laughs> I was talking about Eli, the dead guy. Oh, yeah, good. Because I prefer dashing. Or debonair, maybe. Yeah, I'll try to keep that in mind. People are saying she killed a man in cold blood. If you don't mind me asking, what did happen exactly? That they were arguing and that she went crazy over nothing? Look, things got out of hand. Clementine was only trying to make a point, but then... You make it sound so casual. Best thing is probably for you two to leave town. And get back to your group. We were attacked earlier this evening. There were four of us. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. If there's... If there's anything I can do to help. Well, not that I have much to offer you, but... I know a thing or two about losing family. Hey, it's okay. You've done enough. I hear you, but... Eleanor? You done yet? Just about. All right, here's what we're gonna do. I'm driving you that junkyard myself. Get you out of my hair, and no one can say I didn't do right by no one. In the meantime, you two can sleep right here and think about what shitheads you were earlier. On my terms, and on my timeline. You got me? All right. Fair enough. Fair enough? Go kiss a skunk's ass. I should be earning a goddamn Boy Scout badge for this. Trip, it doesn't seem right to wait. Javi's people, they could need a medic. Nah, no way. Not putting you in that kind of danger again. That's not your call. Look, maybe there's another way. We've got a rear gate down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but, well, we could leave tonight. Slip past the herd, get a jump start on reaching that junkyard. Something tells me Trip won't be too happy about you sneaking us out the back door. He'll get pissy. 
but he'll get over it. Sometimes with him, you gotta ask for forgiveness rather than permission. Anyway, think about it. I've got to check on some patients, but I'll be back in an hour. You know, I never would have guessed she had it in her. Yeah, she's... She's something. The thing is, is, and maybe this sounds weird, but I still trust Trip more than I trust her. We're leaving tonight, with Eleanor. If it gets us there even a minute sooner, it's worth it. All right, I'm in. You know, when I met you, I thought you'd just be another asshole like everyone else. And to think that when we first met, you nearly blew my head off. <laughs> yeah, guess I made the right call. Sounds like Eleanor will be a little while. Maybe we should get a few winks. Good idea. I'm exhausted. I'll get the lamp. Dinner. Aren't you hungry? <sighs> We're out of food, AJ. We're gonna starve. I'm starving. We gotta... AJ, stay here while I find us dinner, okay? <coughs> Tell me you understand. <sighs> it's okay. I'll stay close. Don't worry, you'll see me right through the window. Just look for my hat. Sun's up. <sighs> Chip's probably mad as hell by now. What do you think he'll do to you? Oh, nothing. He'll yell at me a little. Chip and I, we sort of used to be a thing. It was for like five minutes, and it fizzled out fast. But he never really got over it. Relationships can change pretty fast, and they're never not complicated. Sounds like you've got something on your mind. Or someone. Guys, that's the place. Yeah, this is it. Oh, shit. I'm 
guns out, yeah? If you insist. Jesus. Must have been hundreds of them. Kate's good in a crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? Listen to what you said. Lock yourself in and don't come out, not even once it's quiet. It kept running through my head like on a loop. Did they hurt you? Are you okay? I hid before they could get to me. I'm fine. Really. Kate and your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate yelled that they were gonna try to make it back to the van. And that's where we're headed. Let's go get your brother back, sweetie. Oh no. No sign of them. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. Kate. They're trapped in there. Mariana, stay back. Wait! Nobody shoots. He's right. We fired the truck. We might hit them. Another couple of minutes, we might not have been, but then you showed up just when it really mattered. Yeah, well, that's kind of my thing. Oh. I, I wanted to come after you. I, I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. I thought we were dead. Like, never gonna see you again dead. We only had a couple bullets left. You're still alive, aren't you? So is Kate, so is Mari. That's all that matters. I was just so scared. I'm here now. You don't have to be scared. Hey, you hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, at least it's not a bite. Eleanor, think you can take a look? It's okay. I'm a doctor. I'll clean it here, then patch you up back home. See? Better already. We should be getting back. Don't want to push her luck. Who's the kid with the gun? She have a name you want to share with us? She saved my life. Pulled this crazy stunt. Let me get the upper hand on the asshole who took me away from you guys. Her name's Clementine. Hi there. Glad I was able to help. Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. I like the sound of that. Oh my god. Javi, do they have hot water? Even, like, lukewarm water would be okay. Eh, don't get your hopes up too high. It's a nice place, but it's not the Ritz. Well, whatever they've got, I'm sure it's gonna be great. You look happy. I am. Search and rescue missions don't usually end so well. Alive and healthy. Well, let's wait to celebrate until we're back behind the walls, okay? 
I want to jinx us. I'm just happy for you is all. When we get back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I haven't forgotten about our deal. You couldn't have known what happened to your van, but still, I need some way out of here. Don't worry. I haven't forgotten our arrangement. I know it's not the easiest thing to find, but... Cool. Thanks. shooting again. I'm gonna fucking kill him. I'm gonna kill all of them. That's not gonna bring her back, Javi. So what? I'm just supposed to let him live? If you really want to help your family, you'll come with me. We can't wait anymore. We stay here and we finish this. Are you crazy? We have to go now. I already killed one of you. If you don't stop them, they're gonna come after your family again. Let Eleanor help them. You stay with me. What? No, Javi, you have to come with us. Javi, please! Trust me, Javi. We have to end this now. No, Javi, please come with us. Get her back to Prescott. We'll cover you. Javi! Go with them. I'll be fine. I need your help, Gabe. Just keep firing until they're out of sight, okay? I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> 